put rocks or some shit. We have a here. declaration to write. Oh, uh, so Nick C. <laughs> oh, there's no freedom in this the, match. The, the Falcon. He's going to air wobble. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that's his plan today. He's going to mash. Um, but let's see if Brock is going to match harder. Yeah, both of these characters love to combo, love to just completely oppress the hell out of the uh, their opponents, regardless of whoever the opponent is. So I can see this being a very bloody, fast-paced match. So, um, fun fact. So, Nixie did play um, MKLeo at the last at Smash and Splash, I believe. Um, and it was a 2-0, but it was last hit both games. So, uh, 2 0 close games. But, nonetheless, Nixie does have experience in this matchup. And Joker doesn't particularly like other rush down characters. He doesn't like other ones playing by their own rules. <laughs> and if there's any player who's taking a character and just doing their own thing, it's definitely going to be Nick and his Falcon. Yeah. yeah, Nick Nick is one of those guys, like, he's in he's in the lab, stream monstering all the time about stupid Falcon combos that he can do. And his recoveries are really good, and but you can't do anything about that. Joker's just out there. Yeah, now back air edge guarding. You don't even need Arsene out there. You can easily get a character yeah. like Falcon. Oh, and that, oh, that gun to back air, that was quick. If you do single hit gun, you can actually get a remarkable amount of follow ups. Like, it's kind of disgusting what this character can do. Yeah, if you did gun to down smash, uh, true combo, correct? Uh, at certain percentages. Ooh. And then down air with arson leads into damn near anything. Wow, wow he got. That was a. <laughs> that was the angle. <laughs> Even Nick. <laughs> you see Nick's face, he's just like, what angle was that? Nick came in at a bad angle trying to intercept the grappling hook. And also, Stadium 2 is one of the best stages for Joker to recover on. Like, not only is there just a lot of vertical space for him to drift forever and a half backwards with, but Grappling Hook has a lot of really oh, good he angles. Went, he went for the knee. Oh, yeah, now Arson's game. Now, okay. So, that side B actually has zero lag. But why? Um, Sakurai said it was okay. But and it's that, not okay. And, no, and somebody decided <laughs> to give Falcon that down air hitbox, because why? Why not? Why not, guys? We're trying to keep the game even here. Yeah. Um... Yeah, right now, Nick is just honestly just pushing forward. Because um, thing about Joker is Joker is a very methodical character, right? So, you know, having him set up and, like, set up his little zone thing is kind of kind of bad for you. Like, once he establishes where he wants his combo to be, that's where it is. And very clean combo at the corner is going to lead us mm -hmm. through the game. And it looked like Nick air dodged in the blast zone. That killed him. Like, air dodge killed him. And, um... Yeah, Falcon's a particularly bad offender of that, where the hurtbox shifting on air dodge... Coupled with the fact that directional air dodge kicks you back a tiny bit in, yeah, in the opposite direction you want to fly. Yeah, there yeah. you go. Why are these boys dancing? Uh, I don't know. Get, get these goons out Can of here. Can we um, DQ everybody there? <laughs> DQ uh, Bao, Amin, and definitely DQ Jewel. <laughs> definitely. Can, can someone call, call one of the zookeepers real quick? Definitely just get Jewel out of here right now. Yes, DQ all. Oh, all it's a meme with his red pill. Oh no, that's not a good sign. Oh no. Music and memes are funny. Okay, um, there's Roxas. Uh, we're going back to PS2. Um, you know, it was a good, good stuff on Roxas. We're taking Nixie's stocks like fairly early, right? Because like, if you let Falcon live and let him do his nonsense for longer, like, you could be pretty bad for you. So this is the problem oh. that I have with game one is that Nick's trying to play this at the ledge, but. I feel like Falcon isn't fast enough off stage to really intercept any grappling hook play. Mm. And Joker has to put like minimal commitment into any of his moves to really edge guard Falcon. Yeah, and I, I think I think the the method of thinking is is like it's to kill Joker before he gets a chance to get our sin. And I think you know Nick is trying to employ that. Um, hasn't been working out for him. It's like you know one of those high risk high reward strategies. Because right now Rox is moving, especially with the guns. You know he's just keeping away. He's trying to stay mobile, and that's. Especially good against Falcon. Like right now, the counterplay to the character is what's keeping Rox's head far above water. And yeah, Arson's already gone, man. And you know, thing about that's the thing about Arson, right? Like people say to camp him out, but he it takes so long for Arson to actually run out. It's like a full thirty seconds. Yeah, and you can't passively like zone around Arson. Like you have to like actively get rid of him. The more percentage Joker's gonna take while Arson is out, the quicker Arson's gonna go away. Yeah. And on top of that, you're getting closer to your end goal, just killing Joker. Yeah. He's trying to pummel up there. He wants that up there, up there. He's trying to play ink play. Ooh, okay. Got the dash tech, though. You know, Nick only a 62%. Yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. Forcing Nick to jump with that, um, the grappling hook. Ooh, oh, yeah. Oh, that was cute. All right, so down gun to drag down up air, uh, if that works. And that could be 
fairly lethal on a character like Falcon. His recovery isn't the hottest. Yeah, and he took a jump in that string also. But Nick recovering with that. Um... Oh, and that was pretty unfortunate because that actually confirmed into an up smash. Got second of Arson, but took that stock anyway. Like, thankfully for Joker, like, he's able to converge on hits regardless. Mm -hmm. But yeah, Joker's hit of down air where he, like, swipes the knife intercepted Arson's part. Really funny interactions with how the character works, where Arson's sort of like his own thing. He's like an intangible Luma, which, when you say it out loud, sounds horrifying. Yeah, it sounds terrible. <laughs> but maybe Joker's just that kind of a terrifying character. Oh, yeah, he's throwing out S-Match. The S-Match is really strong. So I don't blame him for doing it. He's going to go out there. I feel like oh. if Nick was just a bit more patient at the ledge, didn't bother to go off stage. Oh, or he has no jump. Ooh, how's this going? Oh, he's coming back. Okay. Like, I think Nick just needs to pick safer options. Because, like, let Roxas come to him. Because Roxas is playing fairly aggressive. Oh, yeah. Got the tech roll away with the um, up smash read. Man. Yeah. Like, Joker's allowed to play aggressive, but he can't survive forever. You're not going for trades evenly with Falcon. Yeah, it's just like, I feel like Nick is just trying to intercept. Oh, oh uh, yeah. Uh, Up guns. What? Up guns is brutal. <laughs> what? So, like, it looked like Roxas was holding just for too long. Uh -huh. He didn't get his the let go of the gun, so instead of inputting into grappling hook immediately, he ended up buffering up gun. And the animation for Upgun is hella slow because, you know, Joker's got to spin around with his pistol, unload the whole clip, Ooh. and in that time it took, Rox just, just wasn't close enough to grapple. Yeah. And can we talk about that for a second? So, you saw that down there, right? So, um, Joker and Arson are two separate hitboxes, right? And most of the time, like, they link into each other, but that was one of the times where um, Arson's hitbox, I believe, hit first and Joker's dagger hit him, which why it's hit him sideways. Yeah. Because Joker's down there sent you sideways. So that was one of the few times like that confirm got messed up by Joker. So, um, but yeah, I mean, whatever. So they're gonna go to Kalos, man. Ooh, interesting choice. Yeah, I yeah. feel like this is actually gonna give Nick more options at the ledge, which. Oh yeah, the wall jump, man. Like the wall jump, he's gonna be able to cover the platform, which Joker loves to be able to play around that platform for more defensive Hot options. I'm actually surprised Roxas didn't swap off of Joker for this just because... I think this is a character, man. Like, he's clearly rocking the Joker well. Three, two, one, Nonetheless, we'll see what happens in game three. Yeah, immediately starting out with the guns. Quick 9%. Yeah, if anything with Kalos, there's going to be a lot of room for gun strafing. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Who's the thief now? <laughs> oh, man, that was... <laughs> Yeah, man. Um, I feel like this this is why you know Nick kept going off stage because he knew he knew there was a chance that he could get that. I feel like that's just ingrained in Nick's blood, though. Like he'll do that to anyone, any character, any time. He's trying so all up gun. So he's trying so he's trying to get weak knee when he does that, and uh, up gun again, like you said. It's just it's devastating just because like that little buffer costs you so much time in the air, and if you don't have Arsene, oh, there's no. no hope of coming back. And if Nick was just a little bit more bold there, he could have caught Wings of Rebellion and just ended the set right then and there. Yeah, okay, yeah, that's the yeah, that's the that's the that's the combo, it's a true combo. And because oh, of yeah. the higher ceiling, he's living. Yeah, Nick's going for it, I don't blame him. Oh yeah, and mix see, like you said, he's mixing up his recoveries with that wall jump just there. Yeah, I feel like Rox has dug himself into a corner with the set. Regardless of the SDs that occurred. Yeah. yeah. Like is gave Falcons like more options recovering when the whole set Roxas was just calling out all of Falcons recoveries. Like he really had Nick pinned down. Yeah. And now he just sort of opened the cage and look what happens when you open the cage on this. Uh, I'm glad. <laughs> I thought Nick was gonna go for a Falcon kid like an idiot. He could have done some dumb something dumb. Yeah, I'm, I'm glad he did because he would have just died. Okay, let's see what Roxas Roxas can do right now. Roxas is arson, so you know he could get a lot of got a lot of real estate covered with this. You can get a lot of damage. It's not too difficult to cement a kill, especially if you keep things at the ledge. Oh, yeah. Got that back air, push him to the ledge. Yeah, and that forward smash can hit below the stage, below the ledge, so. It also hits a little bit further upwards and outwards. It's just fantastic. But I guess so he is the jab. Yeah, he didn't die. What's the option? What's the option? Yeah, 150% man. AI into the neutral. is the, That's the shook option. 
That's where you know Rox is trying to scramble for some ground. Yeah, he's here. trying to get him away from me. Yeah, you died. Oh no, he's trying to pummel to 160, I believe. You get the up there. Lightning not coming through for Nick, but a low recovery gets him back on the stage. That's still not coming. Oh, yeah, still not going to kill. Okay. So Nick better watch out, man, because, like, think about it, it's like he could take. Uh, Rocks could take the stock right now, and it looks like Joke would be online by the time he takes the stock. But uh, stuffing out everything I just said with an air. Yep, not enough time for anything to happen. Rox is digging his own grave and letting Nick trample all over it. Amen. Oh, God. Uh, has, um, exclamation point Falcon in the chat right now, please. Um, yeah, so I'm going to be right back. I have a, I have a master go play. Best of luck, Bars. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Who are you rocking these days? Cloud and Pika still? Uh, no, Cloud Pit. Pit? Yeah, Cloud okay. Pit. Yeah. All right, peace, bro. All right, meanwhile, let's see what other ads we got rolling. Oh, I know what I'm going to shell. I'm going to shell one of my favorite events of the year as soon as this replay ends. The psych. I'll let all these replays go. All right, let's see how it is. Okay, Devin. Nice and there. Defend the North! <laughs> 